So this is a message for Leo, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Message for Leo, please. It's very fast. We have the Ace of Thought. We also have the Thor of Thought. A lot of thinking here, okay? This cherub has arrived to congratulate you on a brilliant new idea, which is truly inspired. It's important to communicate clearly and thoroughly with others that are involved in the implementation of your ideas. Don't be dissuaded by little challenges along the way. These are merely course corrections to perfect your plan. And then we also have spent time in nature, okay? Listening for guidance from your angels, your guides, and your own inner voice because overanalyzing a situation isn't going to provide the answers that you're seeking. Consider taking a vacation or a little small break or, or like a little vacation, day, a road trip um, to become clear on what your next step should be. Meditation will always be very helpful, okay? So this is a lot about... Um, Really, I'm getting for you guys to really just connect with yourself, being out in nature, because I feel like when you do, there's going to be a lot of really good ideas coming to you, okay? Especially in nature. Um, if you're by water, definitely connect with the water. If you, you know, uh, trees, being, you know, and even if you can't do that, even spending time just with your window open, getting in that fresh air, try to meditate, try to do some breath work, because I feel like really good ideas coming to you. Let's see what else we have. It's about not overanalyzing. Oh, wow. We've got the King of Pentacles and we've got the King of Cups. Okay, so this is something that I definitely feel is going to be... Um, for some of you, there's two males that are helping you with this. But also, I feel like that this is something that's really going to bring in, um, bring about your emotions. It's something you're going to really, really uh, want to cherish. Really, uh, I feel like you're going to be very guarded about it. Um, and I feel like this is something, um, wow, and underneath we've got the hermit, where... Uh, I feel like this is something you've been wanting to do for a long time. And I also feel like this is where your soul is uh, really driving you. Okay, so definitely check out your north node uh, and which house that is, which uh, sign it's under. Because I feel like this is really a time of you connecting with the earth. Okay, we have the earth sign. We also have water here. So as I had said, connect with the, with the uh, water. Connect also with spending time in nature, you know, in the woods. You know, whatever you can do. Because I feel like when you do this, when you're really... Because we have the... Uh, they're both kings here, right? They're not pages. They're being on... They're on their throne. They're, you know, connecting with, you know, being still. There's a lot of solitude. A lot of solitude. Really just listening. Connecting with yourself. Listening. Because I feel like great ideas. Great ideas that are really going to bring out your emotions. Um, your uh, your passions. Um, and being I, I like some sort of, uh, you know, you're going to get some sort of reward for this. Okay? Like, um, it, it's some sort of, it could be money. It could be, you know, you helping other people, which makes you feel fulfilled. This could be a great idea that, you know, that brings in a lot of security for you. I feel like honestly, this is, um, where you could also become like your own boss, you know, having your own business, starting up your own business. This could also be like, you're a mentor of some sort. You could be, um, you know, you could have the next most brilliant idea. I just feel like right now it's not about like, rushing, you know, like, what do I do next? What do I, it's really just not over analyzing the situation. Okay. Whatever that is for you, whether it's relationship, whether it's job, whether it's a passion that you want to connect with, whatever area this is for you, I feel like it's about just not being like, when is it going to happen? Like I've been waiting, I've been manifesting. When is it going to happen? I feel like it's, it's really just about, um, this time of really nurturing yourself and really listening to your intuition, because I feel like really good ideas are right in front of you. We have the, they're right in front of you. The light is literally that light bulb is right here. Right. Okay. So it's a really, um, it's a really strong time for you to just celebrate you really, um, you know, this idea coming, I just keep getting idea that it's going to be very, very uh, financially good for you. Also, I feel like emotionally, you're going to be drawn to this, okay, this new idea, okay, so and you could also be presenting this idea to two different people. Okay, um, could be a Pisces could be an Aries here. I mean, I'm sorry, 
I said Aries, or Taurus, okay? So it could be Pisces, it could be a Taurus, it could be Aries, um, but I feel like it's in regards to um, your finances, to be honest with you. I feel like it's it's finances. Um, it's some sort of investment where it's like, should I invest in this? Should I do this? Should I tell people my ideas? And it's it's all about the yes. Like, it's, it's this straight yes uh, right from here, okay? So I feel like... Um, this is a very long message. I know this is very general, but very beautiful. I absolutely love this. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.